happy happy new year guys this is our first video quoted peanuts for the year 2022 all right guys so this is two cups of fresh peanuts i'm going to add hot water to it and then season with salt leave it to stand for five minutes at least and then i'll later rinse the warm water from it and then we'll move to the next stage i hope i'm able to help this video is very very easy to understand easy to follow so i hope this becomes helpful So I let this stand for 5 minutes at least, that's what I remember for now and it's time to strain the water from me. So what I'm doing is I'm straining out the warm water. Now the water isn't hot again, it's like warm like so I'm just straining it from it and then the next thing I'm going to do is that I'm going to spread it on a tray. If you have a flat surface anything you can spread it on just do that so i'm going to divide it into two i mean spread it on a separate tray so that it dries early if i pack it it's going to take a longer time before it dries up so i'm just going to separate it so it dries faster i'll cover it with something and leave it in the open air the sun to dry so this is what i'm going to do and i think i left that for i didn't really calculate the time but once you feel like this is dry enough for me i think you are good to go that will be okay so this is mine here and it's done so they look very dry for me they are like dry like i want it like this the right texture everything i even tasted some it's okay so now these are the things i'm going to use in coating my peanuts and i'm going to mix them mixing wet separately and then mixing dry ingredients separately this is so easy to make Salted peanut doesn't really need much sugar it just has to be a little sweet like that and the reason why I'm adding the sugar to the egg is to make is to dissolve it yeah to evenly dissolve it that's why I'm adding the sugar to the egg So once I'm done adding the ingredients together, now I have my wet ingredients separately and then I have my dry ingredients separately. So once I'm done with this, it's now time to start coating the peanut and it's very simple. This is how I coat my peanuts. I'm not going to do all at once. I told you if I want it perfect and very nice, I have to do it in small quantity. So this is how I'm doing it. I'm going to start with the wet ingredients i'll just pour a little amount get it all wet so i make sure at least every peanut in this bowl is wet and then after i'll add my dry ingredients in beds to make sure at least i'm able to coat every peanut this is how i'm doing it so i'm going to repeat this procedure until i see every peanut coated very well so i'll go through the whole process again and again till i'm done coating every single peanut
anyways if they stick together don't worry just use your hands to break them apart very very simple you just take them break them apart that's all This is deep frying make sure your oil is hot and then as you are frying you put it on a medium so they don't get bent and then you keep stirring occasionally you keep stirring occasionally so that they don't get bent So the first badge is ready at this point it's golden brown and it's very very ready leave it to cool down and you see how crunchy it is or it becomes next badge going in so i'm going to keep frying till i'm done frying every nut At this point, I'm done frying and this is it. It tasted so good when I had a bite and this is a coated peanut. So it's standing so beautiful. This tastes really good and yummy. And I want to use this opportunity to say Happy New Year to you all. Happy New Year to you guys. You are such a real family and I appreciate each one of you. Thank you for the love. Thank you for everything. I wish you all a beautiful New Year.